All right, welcome to part 16 of Grand Theft Auto 5 all cutscenes got to video. Now, um, let's say what are we doing right here? Okay. So we took all those cars. Hello, Franklin. For this lady. Yeah, where Devin at? Somewhere meditating or ripping somebody off? Michael just got kidnapped by the Chinese gang. It's not perhaps the best idea for you two to be seen together for a while. What? Where's the money? Mr. Weston is one of the most brilliant investors. The oh, we don't care. We don't care. Obviously a maverick, but he's also rigorous in his research. Yeah, he may be brilliant. We don't Look, care. Let me be the first to tell you. He ain't gonna fall in love with your ass. He's not. Now where the fuck is my money? He's not. The best thing that could have happened to you in the situation has happened. He what? is going to hold your money, invest it in his alpha fund, and make the funds available to you at a time as the transfer will not induce any. So he's scamming attention. me. He's scamming me. Way of saying I'm getting robbed? Yes. Are you fucking kidding me? That is a short-sighted and frankly immature way of seeing things, Mr. Clinton. Oh my God, Let bro, know. Devin's never gonna love you. Do you not I notice that? And pop, motherfucker. Maturity is not really my fucking thing. Thomas, he's gonna hold it and invest it. He's gonna hold his own money and invest it and forget about it. Thank you. Oh, my N word, huh? What What's up, on? homie, huh? Oh. <laughs> oh. What a Is that how you act, huh? When a friend makes a mistake, huh? No, really? Oh, no. What? oh, so what? It's just me getting hurt? Is that funny? Trevor, it's oh, Trevor. Man, oh, fuck you. I'm going to put you in the fucking ground, you laugh at me again. Man, calm down. Trevor, you. I have met a lot of assholes in my life, but you, oh, you're not long for this world. And Yo. This is the way you fucking act. Yo. You little jumped up motherfucker. Trevor, Trevor. Trevor, Trevor. Ar Ar Trevor. Look, how about this, Trevor, man? Trevor. Calm down. Calm down. It was funny at first, It man. was. I made a mistake. Exactly. Unfortunately, man, you failed. Fell on your face. It was fun. All right? It was. I apologize. We're sorry. I accept. To the victim, I'm some, some, some. Okay. Uh, All right, so. Let's hug it out. Okay. Mm -hmm. Why can't we be friends? Ah, ah, right? Yeah, so fucking you fucking gotcha. Yeah. Oh, fuck, no, I'm not funny. Fucking asshole. Oh, fuck. I, I a difficult. Childhood. Damn, man, you all right? Just, I'm just fucking on edge, you know? Look, I love you, right? But I would have. I would have. Fucking! Look, man. Lester said you had some information. We can't be friends. We can't be friends. Fuck Michael, I hope he's dead. Man, I know y'all two, man. Come on, man. You two had beef before. But what the fuck happened in North Yankton? Somebody pinched him, man. Who? Friend Ron met these Chinese assholes. They're from Yangshan in China. We had some problems. They mistakenly thought Michael was a human being and kidnapped. Yeah, and now it looks like they holding him somewhere in the city. Yes. Come on, bro. Well, go fuck yourself. You want that piece of shit? That's your fucking business. Are all you right? serious? He's dead to me. All right? And chances are, if and when I see him, he's gonna be dead to everyone else as well. Hey, come on, bro, don't do that. You're pushing your luck, pal. Trevor, Trevor, we're not in... Trevor. What was that? What was that? Uh, Trevor, he didn't even say nothing. Uh, asshole! Everybody! Assholes! I told you! He ain't my G laugh. Don't try to <laughs> me. Not He's not his what? He's laughing at you, you You're not his idiot. <laughs> You're making a mistake. It costs a lot of money to track you down. I had to call in every favor I could in the Midwest. Oh and wow. Then you two several good men. Good day, huh? Good day. Good fucking day to you. Kill him. Hey, hey, the Phillips isn't coming. Uh oh. Um, he about to put him in the grinder. Hey, that's a big fucking mistake. Uh oh. This is what we have to use, like that little app on our phone, right? The Find My iPhone, right? Now you strap, man. There it is. Uh oh. Oh, this is clutch. You want to bleed? Uh oh. Michael, there it is. Come on, Michael. 
There it is. Oh, wow, that's a hard fall. All right, then I'll see you. Show. Hey, sure you don't want to come in? What, your big empty ass house? Dog, I'm depressed enough already. All right, well, listen, thanks. Look, go. What the fuck happened up here? I said, Trevor went crazy, tried to kill me, I got jumped by the Michael, tell him the truth. Man, before all that, I'm talking about the fade. Trev, this guy Brad, man. I know what you meant. All right. Look, I made a judgment call. Uh-oh. I don't know if it was the right one. I did what I thought I had to do. Uh-oh. I had a young family, Franklin. I was running with a crew of crazy motherfuckers with nothing to lose. I saw an out. A future for me, for my family. I took it. You took it? Man, you burned every motherfucker you've ever known. It was that or die. <sighs> Look, I know it sounds cold. I don't expect you to understand it. Not yet, but you will. When you got ties of your own. Look, you wake up one day, and, and your legs, they just give. You just can't run anymore. Now Franklin is, uh, he's contemplating if, if you should man, trust look, Michael. You watch your back, all right? When Trevor finds out you're still alive, I don't know what the fuck he gonna do. Don't worry about Trevor. He's not gonna get near me. Hey, you watch your back. You hear me? Oh, it ain't me he coming for. True. We straight. It's you, dog. It's you. Just say. Oh, well. well. <sighs> I, I I guess you can call this a kerfuffle. All right, looks like we're on the uh, we're on a movie movie set. Oh my, that car was nice. Ooh. We had a deal. We had paperwork. Hey. Fuck off, Johnny. Hey, you're a couple Johnny. of asses. Put a beat down on an old man. Yeah, we don't yeah that is that. crazy. We have a deal hey. with them. Just about. Please, get those millennial ass wipes. With pleasure. I'm pretty sure we killed them, right? I think you have the option to, like, kill them or, like, beat them up. Come in. I think most of us killed them. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Turns out maybe I'm cut out for the movie business after all, huh? My friend, you're a sentimental thug with zero artistic training and nothing interesting to say. I would say you're overqualified. <laughs> anyway, shut up and take a look at that. Uh oh, associate producer. Oh. oh, fucking a. Feels good, doesn't it? What Feels is that like position in real life? Like, what does that mean? Life. Actually, done something movie welcome to show business nothing but make-believe will ever feel quite real i wonder what that means though like do they just like fund the movie or what like what is it show you some rushes i think you're gonna love it but it'd be great to hear your notes okay hey baby i just wanted to tell you i'm finally doing something with my life oh nice movie nice real one call me I know. Comment down below. What's the most amount of money you've ever had in GTA 5? See, we're about to do something really, really bad. So I need to present myself as a proper textile magnet. So you stop making anything? No, so the tax won't be on his neck. It's more suspicious in America than someone who's actually prepared to make something. <laughs> Jesus. What about you? Oh, pocket, Trevor. We're having some problems. Okay. Brad. What else? Yes, anyway, the Union Depository is on hold for now. Can't do it without him, especially now that he knows. True. Thank God you guys are here. You alone? Davey, where's your boyfriend, Steve? He's on his way up. Oh, yeah, my God. Yeah, they're up here. Listen, this shit's about to hit the fan. Our entire lives together has been nothing but a series of fans and shits. Sort this problem out for me, and I will get Mr. Leisure Wear off your back. And if we don't? Then I will go to jail, and you will get shot. Ah, fuck you, Dave. I've heard it all before. Not Facts. Like this, you haven't. Has he briefed you? Oh, well, yes, he has. He told us that if we do what you say, 
And together we can take down the big bad wolf that is government corruption. Yeah, and if you don't, we're all gonna fry. Huh, not me. Us. I've even got some fools in our own bureau that are questioning my methods. You're a weirdo. <laughs> I'm a liar. You are. A cheater. You some are. Kind of a killer and a thief. You are. So, so there's some uh, evidence, and I need you guys to find out what they know. <sighs> all right. So what? Well, unless you're here to hack into the system, wipe it all clean. Oh no, no, that will not work. The only way to access it is through your building. Oh my! Fuck me. <laughs> so Michael, weird, bro. You'd be doing me a very big favor. Bro, I hated doing and missions for do this weirdo. I will make sure that all your files are deleted. I promise you. Hey. Why would I even take a promise from you? It's the last thing we do, and we're done. Period. Of course, I'm a man of my word. Dave, let's go. Weirdo. Come on, Lester, let's go. Good luck, gentlemen. Um, bro, I can wait to kill him. I'm gonna be honest with you. Hey, I'm gonna be honest so with you. you Listen, any idea how we'll do this? I'm not a brutal guy down. or whatever. Not I couldn't really, wait to kill him. I we'd start by finding a way into the building. I'm sorry. I'm going I... in through the parking lot? No, no, no. We're waiting for someone to come out of it. A janitor. All right. And how's that gonna get us in? Well, the janitors are all on temp contracts. They get replaced when their backs go, or they ask for a day off. So we find one of these guys, we turn him, and that's our end. Oh, this okay. is what we're, this is whenever we um guy? we rob the janitor. The temp company's database right now. We found a guy about to for his job. File. Whoever's driving needs to, needs help. Harvey Molina, license plate eight three Q S L seven two two. Follow him. See what we think. Sounds good. Hey, whoever's driving, I'm gonna be honest with you. Do better. Here we are. Do better. Let's wait for him. <laughs> oh man. I bro, I got tired of just doing missions for this bum. Oh, whoa. sneak into this building. Here and... we go. Are, are you not looking? I think the guy had a red car, right? I think I think the guy had a red car. This is not the car no, we're looking for. No, that's not for. it. So, what do you think about this whole messed up situation? Uh, I think they'll either kill you after this is done, true. or keep you doing these stupid jobs until they don't have to kill you because someone else has done it for them. Lever yeah, that's that the point. About right. Yep. Absolute horrible. Can't lie to you. Ooh, what's this? That's not his car. Uh, not our guy. No. So, what do we do? Uh, what can we do? We do the job. Then maybe you can delete the files when you're inside doing whatever else you're doing. That might be a way out. True. Yeah, well, a way out is exactly what I need. I believe the guy had a red car, right? Am, am, am I not mistaken? No, that's not Something's it. Something's coming. Oh, no. Ew, that car. Is, no. No. Nope. It's hard to get motivated on a job without financial incentive. True. You can't put a price on freedom. Well, that spur won't be there for the crew. Now, I'm going to ask Mr. Haynes for a budget. Maybe the leftover cash from the Polito score. We need something. Yeah, see what you can do. Hey, I, I am molested on that one. I mean, it's kind of hard to, like, you know, sneak into a building and act like a janitor and, you know, delete files, you know, for free. I agree with him on that one. I don't think that's it either. No, it's not that's it. That's not it. I agree, though. Like, like no shot. Like, we're, uh, you know, we're sneaking in, in into a building. You know, and doing all this for free. There's no way. Like, there's actually no shot. I thought his car was red, I think, but maybe I'm wrong. That's it. Did you look? look um, sir? Sir? Did he just leave the... There she is. That's him. Yep, yep. Now, I believe... Now, listen... You got another one of those, Harvey? I'm gonna explain. Give me one second. Who are you? The guy with your best interests at heart. Fill your pockets with money. All you gotta do is take a little vacation. Hey, I work two jobs, man. I'll take any break I can get. Good. Hey, you want the beer? Nah, I'll just take the overalls. Oh, and your ID. It's in there. Oh, and Harvey. I probably don't need to say this. But you don't play ball? I'll be forced to do something I really don't want to do. Enjoy your beer. So the original idea was to sneak behind him and shoot him in the like hey, shoot him with a gun. Problem, that was the Steve original script. But they changed it. Of course it. it's Steve fucking Haynes. It's always Steve Haynes. That is not strictly true. 
It's either Steve Haynes or it's Trevor or it's his family. It's always one of them. Yeah, that's true. It is always one of them. Well, fat old fuck with a horrible family and even worse friends. <laughs> I ain't a good role model. We know. Yeah, whatever, dog. It's either this or dealing dime bags. The bullets come cracking at your ass either way. True. Thanks. We need to find out something about this FIB building, a weakness or a way in. Next time I meet a morally destitute, totally delusional, highly corrupt government agent. I hope he's a nice one. Man, I'm not going in that motherfucker by myself. No, no, no. no. Nobody is going in. We need to do some recon. We need a little more information. She. I need the architectural plans. They're not online anyway. I'm gonna need paper copies. Now, the architect's name is Chip Peterson. This was his first big commission, and the office is down in Backlot City. All right. Franklin, you go tell him for a little while, and then we'll talk. All right, dog, I got you. Hey, man, stop, bro. We all need a friend like Franklin, bro. Oh, good, good, good. Listen, we all need a friend like Franklin in our lives, bro. I promise you. Somebody that's down to help you out. Reuniting the family. I, I really like this part right here. When the family comes back. This is nice. Alrighty. What movie is that? That's a nice house. Let me be honest with you. Oh, look at the devil. Oh. Hey. I'm sorry I spiked you, okay? I just, I get so mad and I can't control things. I, I, and then, listen, it's fine. You know, shit just falls on top of me. I know. My life sucks right now. I know. I don't know what to do except it's fine. I want to say I love you and hug it out. But all that do it. shit is just, well, I'd say gay, but I have some friends who are gay, so that's not cool anymore. And the ones oh, that I don't God, really like, bro. it's not because they're gay. So lame all right you are just a lame and angry psycho sometimes you do bad shit and things i don't know if i love you and i'm pretty sure i hate you a little bit but i'm just so fucking upset that we can't even see each other and you're just a drunk lame dad and you're a drunk lame son you're you know a boring you, you are disrespectful the nicest thing anybody's ever said you me. disrespectful idiot what are you talking so about you buy me a car what i mean not in this so will you buy me a car kind of way in a completely off topic can you buy me a car? how about you be a better son i'm a, a fat shit that you ruined no and, you and secondly i will get a job and i will stop smoking pot in that sort of way okay i love you too son now he can go get a job because i don't have the money to buy you a car besides which way I'm probably gonna be dead in a couple weeks anyway. Please don't die. Okay? Well, Michael, you can't be saying that though. It's great catching up with you too, dude. Yeah. Jimmy, you, you can you know you can just hug your father, right? It's not gay yeah. to hug your father. How's your mother? Oh, she's great. No, she's not. She's bored. I mean, all this mesmerizing tantric sex she's been having with a much younger, better built, caring and compassionate man is great and all. What's she gonna do for the other six hours of the day? What oh the my fuck? God. I'm just winding you up, you miserable bastard. She's mad at you. She's scared that you're gonna die, and she wants you to go over there and prove that you give a fuck. All right, all right, all right. I can take a fucking hit. Let's go. We'll get Tracy on the way. Tracy, on the other hand, uh -oh. she's a star. Sort of. What does that mean? No, 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 no. What does that mean? What does that mean? She's just. Excuse me, I'm trying to write a screen. Sure, then go sure, home mom. and write this. And go hey, home and write the screenplay, then. Michael. Hi, mom. Hi, Jimmy. This is true. Hi, Amanda. Holistic well-being. I don't think. Hey. Maybe they shit once a year between them. Hey, oh. Yo, what's it? Yo, what's your problem? Amanda, come. I have a new unit on hold. You must pay for it. Hey. Hey, buddy. I'm gonna ask politely that you show my wife a little respect. Red meat has been blocking your chi as well as your digestive tract. Oh yeah, you think you're funny? You gonna go there, Michael? Don't. I'm gonna ask you one time, nicely. Michael, Tell him. Just hit him, please. Shush, woman. Anything for you, sweetheart. Uh oh, there goes the MacBook. There goes. <laughs> we had it on Word doc. It saved automatically. Alive? Mm. Yeah, 
he's fine. Ooh. Listen, Amanda. I wanted it. I'm meaning to say to you. I just. What he's trying to say, Mom, is that he's a pathetic old drunken mess and he needs you. And you could do a lot better than a prima donna yoga instructor with an anal fixation. Someone shut up! <laughs> I guess we could try. All I'm asking for is a shot. <laughs> Neutral ground. Dr. Friedlander's office. Oh no. Perfect. All of us. I'll pick up Tracy and bring her there. Meet you? Fine. All right, you. Come on, get up, you idiot. Uh, yoga? No, no yoga. Uh, All right, you know where your sister is, right? Yeah. Let's go. Wait, 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 but what about that sugar, caffeine, and emulsified pig fat flavored beverage I want? Another time. Oh, I'm looking for something hip that uh -oh. you know, says I'm capable of violence, but I'm awesome in the sack. Oh, no. So listen, babe. If you want to make it in Vinewood, you got to do whatever it takes. Even if whatever it takes is a depressed borderline alcoholic who hosts the third most popular talent show amongst the 40-year-old female demographic. So you'll let me on the show if I blow you? Oh, yeah, yeah, bro. Yes. And if you could wear Walk in the door and punch that man in the face. Oh, whoa. Yeah, Laszlo. what's you say? Uh, dude, that was entirely out of context, bro. Oh, yeah. Jim, you find the ink slinger, sit on him. Laszlo here is going to have a little cosmetic work done. No, please. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Stay put, you lame-ass Mark. <laughs> uh, sure, kid. What? Oh, uh, 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 just got my chunk, okay? Oh, God of a Mark. Are you popping a fucking tent over here? You fucking psycho. Hey, who was here next? Uh, oh, he did his nose. Hey, I would never get a piercing. That's like... Uh, oh. Oh, 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 that looks perfect. I would never Let's get a get piercing. Papa Bear, what's Daddy Number Two gonna think about this? Let's not get him involved. Yeah, let's no. not let's not talk about him. I always uh, thought Trace back. Be classy. Oh, he did chess. Oh, nice. Ooh. You got like a camera phone or a mirror? I can... Oh yeah, I'll get you a mirror. Smash you over the head with it. Oh. Uh, 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 snip, snip. Uh oh. This is a real one-stop shop. Gave him a haircut. Snipe. Signature, my ponytail. How do I get extensions? No, what you gotta get is my daughter, whatever she wants. Facts. Yeah, without sucking on your piddle stick. Look, okay, guys, that was a joke. I'm a clown. I'm a sad, lonely little clown. Hey, you're gonna put her on your show, and you're gonna make sure she looks good. Yep. Look, okay, I got a lot of juice in this town, but I mean, I'm not a miracle. Just Shut up. It. Yeah, make yeah. it work. Better make something happen. Right, let's go. We gotta get to the therapist. What? So. I'll like call you or something, okay? Bye. Never a family that needs therapy. <laughs> I mean, he's not wrong. How do I look? It's not good, is it? Yeah, yikes. All right, well, here Amanda. we are. Hello. Good to see you again, Michael. I'm so glad. Isn't this great? Fantastic. <laughs> So man, Dr. Freeland have been getting free bands off of Michael for years. This is me being positive. Give it up, Michael. The sarcasm. It's one of the reasons I moved out. It's beneath you. No, it's not, Amanda. Trust me. Nothing's beneath me. You know, for someone who <laughs> spends every waking moment working on themselves inside and out, I gotta tell you, the progress has been really fucking slow. How True. How do you know what progress is like, you stupid murdering shit? True. Gee. Oh, because all you do is whine at me. True. All I do is whine. Michael, could you please stop murdering people? True. Michael, could you please stop endangering me and the both of your children? True. You kill people and then you sit in the sun and drink and feel guilty about it. That's true. That is not work. I don't see you complaining on the way to the fucking bank. That's true. <laughs> 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 we're trailer trash, you and me. We were taught to do this. Get a center, Michael. You have no center. Ha! No way. We'll both get a center. 
before that ever happened. You are such a fucking animal, a deranged animal. You fucking ain't right on deranged. Kids, cover your ears. How could I not be? I should have had you locked up years ago, you stupid Do it. shit. Do it. I'll put you in a fucking ground with the rest of them. And that's really all the time. Great. Oh. Great. I think we made some real progress there. This man, Dr. Freelander, just got a free oh, lick. Uh, Michael, <laughs> I hope this goes without saying, but family work is a little more expensive. I know. What, double? Squared. Oh, times four. Of course. Take care now. That man, Dr. Freelander, just got a free bag. So you gonna come home with me or what? Guess we'll give it a try. All right. Kids, Damn it. rooms. If you find dead bodies, cheap women, or Trevor Phillips, we're checking into the Rockford Hills Hotel. I bet their hotels are nice. That man said squared. He just taxed him. Ah, it's Craig. Hey, you got him? Of course I do, huh? Here, thank you. Said squared. So. All good? Sure, homie. All right. Was this shit for real? All right, wait. We're just going to rob the FIB and be allowed to walk. All right, now, before, you know, we, we get into the nitty gritty, I'm going to end the episode, the video, whatever you want. I call it right here. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed part 16 of Grand Theft Auto 5. All cutscenes, you guys, everything comes out. And, oh, subscribe to the channel, by the way. If you guys uh, haven't subscribed, uh, I really appreciate it. And, yeah, bye. See ya.